Okay, I know you're saying, what is that? <laughs> so, you know we all have them, y'all. We have the uh, old bundle that we have to revamp, and this is it. I definitely want to go lighter, and I had a hair that was in better shape than this that I wanted to lighten. But unfortunately, I used up all my developer, and it's 101,000 degrees outside, and I'm not going out there to lift my hair when I already have um, pretty high lifted hair. It's a little higher than my liking, but I know I can work it out, you guys. Anyway, so you see, I took out the thread um, out of the wefts. I'm already in the process of getting it detangled. I'm using like, I'm telling you, I need to go to the beauty supply store, but I'm not going. I have like all these little bootleg from freaking relaxers. <laughs> so I'm going to use these bootleg products and revamp this hair. Watch, I'm going to work it out, y'all. You know, we can do it. You know what I'm saying? Products are products. And as long as I take care and detangling this, it's going to work out, I guess. Okay. And then... Well, I don't know why I'm saying like that. It's going to work out. After I do all that, gluing it in, I'm going to be sealing after I glue it with the uh, Tony Guy Firming Holding Spray. Okay, so we have definitely de um, detangled this thing, y'all. And it already looks pretty decent without even going through the treatment process. This is pretty good hair. I got... God knows where this hair is from, but you know when they're when they're decent, I hang on to them. Um, of course, I'm gonna have to get rid of these ends. I don't know. We'll see after the treatment. We will see. Um, but I'm I'm definitely going to be a, a customizing the front of my hair. Excuse my ashy hands. But um, yeah, after just combing it out and then also seeing how the track is laying on top of that, you know, higher blonde hair. I think I'm going to be laying that on the very top of my head, especially because my hair, my natural hair isn't treated. I'm not going to be coloring it nor relaxing it for the rest of the year. I'm not going to color it at all, but in regards to relaxing it, that's something I'm not going to do until maybe next year, 2017, or somewhere close to um, my wedding uh, time. So anyway, uh, let's get on to the shampooing and conditioning, shall we? shampooed the hair and I of course put the conditioner in it um I said to leave it in there for about two to three minutes but I'm going to probably leave it in there for 30 to 45 minutes and maybe even throw it into the microwave so it can have like a a, a deep condition so I will come back to you guys let me go get like a shopping bag and I'm going to stick it in a Walmart bag, stick it in there, and throw it in the microwave. Maybe I'll throw it in there for uh, 30 seconds in two, two, two increments. Okay, I'll be back. Hair it looks so much better, you guys. It's so much better. It got a little luster back. Um, not as concerned about the ends as I was before. Okay, now that we rinse this out, we're going to go on to adding the setting lotion. And okay, so I added the setting lotion and I'm going to just let it sit here and air dry, you guys, um, and just get it ready for um, application. <laughs>
edition. You guys saw the whole thing. And this is the end result. Um, I'm very, very, very pleased on how it came out. How my cut came out. I did not use shears, you guys. When you're cutting extensions, I definitely suggest, um, and I am a licensed stylist, so I definitely suggest, not that I'm saying what I say is gold, but what I've learned and what I have um, definitely noticed is when you cut your hair with a razor, extension, excuse me, with a razor, it's a more softer look, it's a more feathered look. Your hair definitely seems to move a little better, okay? Definitely you cut your hair when it's at its most clean state. Shampoo, condition your hair. Um, definitely press it, blow it out, press it out so it can be nice and straight and you can see what you're doing. You can follow your guide, especially if you're not professional and you're doing it yourself. So um, as you saw, I sped up and cut a few layers in my hair because I didn't want that very long, straight look. I definitely wanted um, um, it to have some movement, you guys. So there you have it.